what's going on guys it's Ali in my previous video when I drifted my Datsun 240Z I broke the rim so in today's video we're gonna be 3d printing set of rims I'm thinking about increasing the offset about two millimeters so the car would be wider and looks nicer and also I would like to redesign the calipers the calipers are very simple design no details on it so yeah let's get to work there are some upcoming projects I would like to talk about I already 3D printed Nissan S15 that's the front part and the rear part I'm gonna have to print it in these days it's not a good print but the file looks good I think I have a problem with the extrusion or a nozzle but I already swapped the nozzle with a new one but I'm keep getting that when we are looking at it for disease back uh, the feeling like it's missing something so I 3D printed a spoiler so we're gonna paint that as well and put it on Here are the rims, it's a resin printed, it's 2 millimeters more than offset than this one, so it's ready for painting. Good. And I redesigned the calipers, it's more detailed than the other one. Here are the rotors, this is the front one and here is the rear one. And the calipers, it's more detailed, there is the front one and here is the rear one, it's smaller. These set of rotors and the calipers will be specifically for Skira D5 chassis. You're just gonna need one screw and it will be screwed on the hub carrier. So I will make sure to put the file in the video description box below. If you have a security 5 chassis, you definitely need. All right, let's clean them and get it ready for painting. Alright guys, we just finished painting the rims, caliper, rotors and the spoiler. Let's try to the touch and it came out beautiful. We're gonna put everything on the car, but first we're gonna let that sit aside because we got a package all the way from Australia. Thanks Ricky for sending me this package. Let's crack it open, see what we got. Thanks Ricky for sending me all these, they look absolutely amazing and the detail incredible. I believe they are licensed as well because they look absolutely the same. I used to use these Castrol motor oils for my car but I'm pretty sure they are absolutely the same. What else we got? Bush spark plugs, uh, oil filters, oil cap, that looks nice. Let's put all these at the scale garage.
hope you guys enjoy the project. I will make sure to put the STL files in the video description box below. The rim, the rotor, the caliper, and also the body. If you haven't seen the, how I made the body and how I painted, I will make a playlist and put it in the YouTube card if you want to check it out. So that's it for this video. If you like what I'm doing here, like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.